And when a person is making the changes and they feel it, they, they become excited because they now know, goodness me, this is what it is. What am I going to do about it? And as soon as they accept that responsibility of themselves, okay, I've got this, then the energy starts changing. Then in what makes you passionate about life? Well, I think one of the, the most passionate things is I love to laugh. Uh, I, I think it's real fun to, uh, to see things starting to change. And for me to watch another person starting to heal and to take the responsibility of their life and to, to really see that it's not doom and gloom, but wow, there's a new beginning. Um, I, I get a great excitement out of that. I, I really find it quite amusing. And also what happens sometimes at the end of a process, that both of us have a good laugh, because it was so ridiculous, whatever that belief system that's been sitting there has been holding them. And that's part of the passion that I have, is to watch people make a change. And last up, stay tuned as Vernon Frost takes me through a transformational process to illustrate firsthand what his work in personal development is about. Vernon, would you do a quick demonstration of your work? Sure. What would you like to heal? I think in the context of the current economic climate in South Africa, we'll talk about money, mm -hmm. which is something that most people can relate to right now. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, it's very simple. You can have your eyes open or your eyes closed. Now, if the viewers are watching this, as I'm working with you, they can also start healing at the same time. So, if they are feeling it while you're feeling it, and I say to you a certain sentence, and if they repeat it as well, in their mind, they will also resolve it at the same time. So, it's a win-win for all of us. So, I'll make more money and you'll make more money. I love that. <laughs> <laughs> so, if you focus on the money situation, that you're going through in your, in your life. Where do you feel it in your body right now? If you had to notice in your body, where do you feel it? Somewhere up here. Right. So you have a belief system sitting there. Can you get a sense what age just pops up in your mind now without even thinking? Seven. Seven. And can you recall what may have taken place that was negative? at seven. It was a year after my parents uh, divorced All right. and moved, we moved to Cape Town. Right. And just say, I release, I release all the trauma, all the trauma that took place at that time of my life. That took place at that time of my life. I'm in divine flow. I'm in divine flow. And what are you noticing now in your body? Something feels lifted. Exactly. Now we'll do it again, just one more time, just to give you a feel of something's happened to you now. You're feeling like there's been a release, but you don't really know what it could be. You don't have to. Your Ooh, body is exactly your body is feeling something. Now we'll do it again, like the onion, we'll we'll go down to the next layer. So if you focus on it again, where do you feel it in your body now? I thought it had moved down yes, here. Yes. But, but it's in two areas at the moment. Yes. Now it's in your tummy and also in your tummy. chest and your throat. Mm -hmm. But what is going on is that it's more sitting in the tummy area. So it's now sitting in your tummy area. What age just comes up in your mind now? Three. Okay. So at three years old, and just say this, I release whatever took place at three years old. I release whatever took place at three years old. And also say this sentence. I release this belief system. I release this belief system. That I don't deserve money. That I don't deserve money. I allow abundance of money to move into my life. 
I allow an abundance of money to move into my life. I'm in divine flow. I am in divine flow. What are you feeling in your body now? This is lifted. Right. And there's a slight tingling going through your body now. Mm. Can you feel that? Yes. Okay. Well done. You can open your eyes. Thank you. What you were feeling there was a short process that what I was doing to you so that you could get a feel mm. of data that was sitting in your psyche, in your body, mm. that you didn't know was there. So you've now neutralized enough for things to change. Mm. So, but there's always more, you know. The next layer of the The idea. next layer of I don't deserve. See, because that's where the belief system is really sitting. So once you clear that, more and more will happen to you. It's phenomenal. And I'm sure that our viewers uh, will benefit from that as well. Vernon, thank you so much for joining us here on Free Spirit. It has been really wonderful having you. Thank you for sharing your wisdom. Thank you. It's lovely being here.